there, you're watching Clever Music. I'm Bridget Daly with an exclusive interview with one of our favorite past idols, Anoop Desai. He's hard at work on not one, but two albums, and that's on top of the album he just dropped called 0.0. Talk about a go-getter. We asked Anoop to answer a bunch of questions to bring us up to speed, so check it out. Uh, yeah, 0.0, .0 um, the first of three albums I'll be releasing um, in the next year, uh, dropped uh, in May, and um, it's been great since then. Uh, to be honest with you, I've just been writing. Um, we're writing for the second and third records right now and um, getting all that stuff in production and, and post-production mixing and everything. So it's honestly, you know, we're just we're getting ready for, for the next thing and we're about to release the first single off of 0.0, .0 Uwe. Um, to sort of lead into the second and third records. My music has changed a lot since being a, um, since being on Idol. I, I mean, I didn't really have music before <laughs> before I was on Idol. Uh, I had, wasn't a songwriter at all. Um, but even just in the past, you know, year, my songwriting style has really changed. I think when you have a focus on something, your focus is to be better and better and better each day. You know, you have to have that learning curve where you can. You know, you can take a, an ear to what you've done and say, all right, how do I improve it? How do I make it more like what I envisioned in the first place? And so I think every day that I, you know, sit here and I'm writing, I mean, it's really important for me that I do change. Um, you know, I don't want to change it in the way that, you know, my fans don't know my, you know, don't recognize my music as mine, but I think it is important to, to truly be me, to, to refine and keep refining and keep learning so that um, you know, at the end of the day I'm putting out the best possible product. People who I want to collaborate with are, are I think the people that I'm fans of. I mean, I'm a, you know, I've been an Adele fan for years and um, someone like Ellie Goulding and, and Alison Krauss. I mean, you know, there's so many, I listen to a lot of diverse, you know, music. Um, or I should say my music taste is kind of diverse. And, and so people that I'm fans of, you know, people that have affected me, like I was talking about earlier, melodically, musically, I'm, I'm affected by a broad range of people. I don't know, whatever I'd be doing, I, I, would, it, I would be empty <laughs> in, in some way. I mean, I think that, you know, I, I was very fortunate that I was led to, to do this um, through a number of circumstances, but there's no doubt in my mind that when you find, you know, the right thing for you to do, you know it. And I don't know, I know it. I, I, I love my job. I love, um, I love figuring it out, you know. And uh, before, I, you know, I was in school and I had a number of things that I wanted to do and they still interest me. I mean, anthropology, um, political science, um, they all interest me, you know. But as far as what you want to do, I mean, I think that that's more of a spiritual thing, honestly, so I'm happy that I found it out.